Thank you, Emily. This is an event to change the way people think about manufacturing jobs. Manufacturing Day is happening tomorrow. And local companies are using the day to motivate young people here to get interested in this type of work. 7 News' Christine Scarpelli is live at the very active Cooper Standard yes. Manufacturing in Spartanburg. Hi, Christine. Check out the action. Absolutely. Yeah, Cooper Standard is going strong this morning. You guys got it. So the actual National Manufacturing Day is tomorrow, but it's celebrated all week. And today and yesterday, it's been a really big focus here, especially in Spartanburg County. So Cooper Standard, Cabelco, other companies like that, even race driver number 29, uh, Mr. Dr Briscoe, was at one of these events, going to be at Cowpens Elementary today, just talking to kids about how exciting the manufacturing field is. This is not your typical conveyor belt job that many people may be familiar with. In fact, this morning we're learning that this is something you can start in or right after high school, get a career and get paid well very early. How do we know? Jacob here. Jacob went to Broome High School, found this program uh, visiting one day and loved it. How hard was it to get into this job? Um. Well, with my personality traits, it wasn't really hard at all. Um, <laughs> oh, yeah? Tell obviously, us about that. Um, I got along with Warren right off the rip. His son graduated from Broome High School, so I just the cards, you know, were perfect on as far as how I got, you know, the job and everything. And Jacob, you like working with your hands. You said this is the kind of job that you were really attracted to. Do you feel like, what, what kind of student do you feel like would like this? Um, anybody that, you know, gets into welding, you know, carpentry, uh, electronics, um, if you have an artist mind, we have, you know, something that you could apply your, your skills with, for sure. And Absolutely. then you were telling me right behind me, this is actually something that's going to go on an automobile, right? Yes, ma'am, this is going, I'm pretty sure this is for uh, the, the Chevy SUV, I guess a Suburban. Model. Yes, ma'am. So they're making things that are actually going to be put into use in real life. This is something you can learn more about, even get a, a, a degree paid for through this program. We're going to put all of that up at WSBA.com so other students can take advantage of what Jacob has here. And this morning, guys, you're talking about Halloween costumes. We heard through the grapevine a good one is a chick magnet, Barbie dolls taped on to you. I don't know where we heard that from though. Not Jacob. Yeah. Was not Jacob, but <laughs> isn't that a good idea? These are the minds that work here. The minds. They're Brilliant innovators. Ones. Innovators. Nice. Like yes, it. Fred. Very clever. All right. Thank you, Christine. <laughs> I'm talking about 523 coming.